What's up guys, you're watching another episode of Third Coast Fishing and today we out here at the Texas City Dyke. You know, same as usual, just fishing, trout reds, flounder, you know, anything that's going to be biting. It's really windy today, bad weather, they said it was going to rain all day. I ain't worried about them weather, man. They don't know whether it's going to rain or whether it's not, so screw them. We down here doing a little bit of fishing. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Give us a thumbs up. We've got live shrimp popping cork as always. All the rigs you see this being used, popping corks, leader line, hooks, weights, all that stuff. www.thirdcoastfishingandtackle.com. Support the channel. Appreciate it. Let's get to fishing. All right, let's get rigged up. It's super windy. So, super windy. A lot of rain in the forecast. So it's probably gonna rain on us. But we gotta be out here anyway. So we're gonna make the best of it. Picked up some live shrimp. You know, we're just gonna rock the old, the old trusty dusties. Except for got a different popping cork. I don't know if you guys ever seen these before. But this is what we gotta use. I left the other one at the house, so. It is what it is. All right, we're gonna get all this rigged up. We're gonna put about a, a three, three foot leader treble hook. All right, guys, let's do this. We've got the popping cork rig rigged up. Get the live shrimp. Let's see what we can catch. What's going on, bud? Not a lot. Any luck? Oh, did you? Could have did to that hook, guys. That's them cheap mustad hooks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's a, I think he's a keeper. You gonna go get some live shrimp? Hey, that's why. That's why I always fish with live shrimp, man. Hey, uh, big fan of the show. Oh man, Pre appreciate it, man. Big yes, fan, sir. bro. You and Adventure Bros. Oh yeah, yeah, that's yeah. that's my real good homie, man. Yeah, yeah, I got, I got a live. I'm gonna go get some live shrimp. Yeah, man. I, that's why I always fish live shrimp, man. Because I mean, if they were hitting real hard, like if I catch a couple of more, yeah. What I'll do is I'll uh, I'll try and see if. If I can't catch any with the, the like a DOA shrimp or something go. like that. Yeah. If you have an artificial shrimp, you ought to throw it because he hit it like right when it hit the water. Yeah, try some artificial. It may save you 10 bucks, 15 bucks. Or if they're hitting like that, man, you're more than welcome to some of them shrimp. Oh, I appreciate it. 
Cause if they hitting like that, then then we don't, yeah, then we don't got a problem. You know what I mean? All right, guys, I'm gonna go put this stuff over here, and then I'm gonna go get the big camera so you guys can have a a better view. Like it's super windy, but I mean, I got a bite on the first cast. Yeah, I didn't connect with it because I was just paying attention to something else. And uh, dude, like right when I threw it out, it was another one. And it was a good one. All right, I'm gonna go get the other camera. All right, guys, look at that trout, dude. Man, he mangled that hook. So, we're gonna change her up, put another weight, and put another hook on it. We got another one. It's probably gonna do the same thing, but it didn't lose the fish, it just fell apart. So. He hit almost immediately. fish and a spec keeper so we're gonna stay at this spot for a little bit look at that rain coming in right there yeah it ain't gonna run us out we all right we gonna stick it out All right, guys, we got some rain moving in. Look at that. So we're gonna pack it up and we're gonna head probably, I don't know, we're gonna head down somewhere where it's not raining and do a little bit of fishing there because we got these sand trout. All they're doing is eating up all our shrimp. And that shit is expensive. So I'm gonna pack it up and get out of here and go find another spot somewhere here in the Texas City. All right, guys, I'm sure some of y'all know where we're at. We're at the floodgates in Moses Lake. There's a lot of birds working down there, so I'm gonna give her a shot, see what the, see what's up. All right, we're gonna walk the bank a little bit, get over into this little. Shallow over here. All right, let's see. Get the birds working out there. It's a good sign. We're gonna kind of just walk along this bank right here and kind of cast out and follow it till it gets to right here, and then we're gonna reel it in. All right, we'll get back to you when we hook up. We got something. A ladyfish. <laughs> so we're gonna keep that for some bait. I'm 
another lady fish. What's up guys, another lady fish. All right guys, we done with this spot. Caught a couple of lady fish. And that was about it. All right guys, that's it. Caught a bunch of lady fish, caught that one speck of trout. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up and that subscribe button. See you.